Hey Facebook, Natalie Morales here with News West 9. We're here. As they are about to open the doors, they're opening the doors right now to let customers in. Some have been waiting since 11.30 last night and those customers now finally get to come in and get their iPhone. So they're letting in 15 customers at a time, just in case you're wondering. So if you get in line here, it's 15 in and 15 out. And AT&T has every worker that they have available here working so that they can get you in and out as fast as possible. As you can see, there's already a morning rush here. They ask when you come in that you know exactly what you want, which iPhone, which color, and it just helps things go a lot more smoothly and a lot more fast. So if you could just know exactly what you want when you get in the store, it would help the workers out extremely and it would help things go faster for them as well. There's some people outside waiting to get in now. Like I said, some of these customers have been here overnight camping out since 1130 last night. And for those who don't know, they do have a promotion going on. Um, if you have an iPhone 6 and above and it's in good condition and it's paid off, you can trade it in for the new iPhone for free, but you do have to pay taxes. And we're told they do have iPhones in stock. I know that there was rumors circulating that um, some of them were already sold out, but they do have some. And AT&T is even bringing in some coffee and snacks for those waiting in line and those coming in this morning. We do know here at the store they have every color in stock as of right now. Um, hopefully they don't run out, but And even though they opened an hour early, they are closing at regular business hours tonight, which is 8 p.m. 8 p.m. tonight is when they will be closing. Hopefully the phones last through 8 p.m. Even if they don't, they'll still be open. How long is the line now, Nick? Laugh. Um, there's only three people in line right now, surprisingly. I don't think most people knew that they opened an hour early. So if you can get in here and get here now, um, you can see there's this to block off the line, but there is no line right now. There's only three people waiting outside. Thank you. And already one person walked out with her new iPhone. So she got in and got out real fast. Hi. Sorry. Hi. How are y'all? I'm good. Good. What kind of What company does the iPhone 6 need to be? You can, um, you can put your phone over. Um, they have a promotion you can talk to them. Or um, right now, I'm at AT&T. Um, right now, through AT&T, or you can switch over. Yeah. But you can come in the store and they'll give you more information about but the, you can come in the store and they'll give you more information about that. But they are offering a promotion right now. If you are with another service, you can switch over and leave with an iPhone today. Are you walking out with an iPhone? No, they didn't no. have the color I wanted. Oh, no. So they didn't have the color he wanted. So he, that one customer is walking out with a no iPhone. So if you want one now, I would come now. Um, it's not even really that packed right now, but colors are already going fast. Um, I'm, from what I know, pre-order sales, you know, went through the roof. So now they only have a limited stock. We don't know exactly how much. They can't tell us that, but colors are already running out. 
Do they have them actually in the store? Yes, they do. People are, customers are walking out with them. New iPhones in hand. Silver 128. So Bruce Street is here with some coffee for you this morning. How many phones do they have available today? We don't know that. They really can't give that information over. We just know that they do have them. So your best bet is just to come into the store and see if they have whichever one you want and the color you want. Yeah, or you can always call the store um, and see if you don't want to drive all the way over here. We're at the AT&T store on Midland Drive off the loop. Some customers getting free coffee as they come in. What colors are available? Um, from what we know, all colors were available, but some are already running out. We don't know which colors, so your best bet would be either call or come in. They do have every worker on staff right now working so that you know they can get you in and out as quickly as possible. I mean, some customers came in and out within five, 10 minutes. So right now is probably the best time to come in. People probably don't know that they're open an hour early. So right now it's probably your best bet before it gets packed when they actually open at 9 a.m. For David, no, just I'm coming to David now. We start, yes, Were there different colors? Yeah, they have the same colors as last iPhone release, and um, the silver, rose gold. They also have matte black and then a shinier black and gold as well. Yeah, per AT&T, they can't give us that information, so we just know that they have them in stock here. We don't know how many. They can't give us that information. The coffee here is free for those who want to come in this morning. Again, they are open an hour early, so it's probably best just to come in now. They close at 8 p.m. tonight, which is regular business hours. Actually, Jim, we found out this morning the headphones they come with regular headphones. Um, in order to get the wireless headphones, the buds with no wire at all, you have to order those and I believe they're $99 extra. So they do come with regular headphones. Which is something I didn't know either. I thought that they automatically came with the wireless headphones, but they don't, they come with the regular ones. You can always order the other ones if you want. Again, it's really not as packed as I thought it would be. I think most people don't know that they opened an hour early just for this release of the new iPhone 7. 
so it's probably best to get in here now if you want the new iPhone. There's no line right now. There was only a line um, up until the doors opened at 8. Some people were here overnight. They camped out since 11.30 last night. Again, they have every worker on staff today tending to customers as well as Bruce Street here with some coffee for you as you come in this morning. There is an iPhone box with the new iPhone. She's walking out with it today. Take a little walk around the store for you. This young man here in the corner is one who was waiting since 11.30 last night to get his iPhone today. These new iPhones do have a better camera, so they take better selfies for those people who love to take selfies. Sorry, I had that. Okay, so it starts at six fifty. That's a that's six hundred and fifty dollars for the thirty two gig, and then if you any color, that's any color, six hundred and fifty two dollars. And if you want to double the memory, it's a hundred dollars more on top of the six hundred and fifty. And that's if you don't have any sort of promotions, but they do have promotions going on for you. Again, they will be, they're open an hour early, so they're open right now, and they will be closing tonight at regular business hours at 8 p.m. Don't forget to watch First News at 4, News West 9. We'll have more from the GM here, more about details, um, little things about the new iPhone that you want to know. We'll have more later at the four, on the 4 show. For now, reporting in Midland, Natalie Morales, News West 9.